We're literally just gonna find him and rush him down, whoever it is. And we're just gonna send everything we have at them. You get a free trade route? Okay. It's been forever since I actually played his degree. How big is this dual map, please? I thought Claim at his best. Go Zanzibar, because I think it's gonna be closest to the AI. Give me mining. Give me foreign trade. It doesn't matter. Combat strength. Give me production. Forget the religion. Don't forget Kree Scouts get free promotion. Ah. I did forget. Mmm. Let's do hills. Because we want to get up to ambush. And just make them ridiculously powerful. But here's the thing. I'm pretty sure the war is going to be over before then. We could, honestly, just declare war on Zanzibar. Even though we did just piece them. Get double XP on scouts. Oh, yeah, good point. Good freaking point. Why didn't I think of that? Well, uh... What would you do without us? Probably still win the game. <laughs> uh... I also play a lot looser on live streams too because I'm talking to you guys, but eh, animal husbandry, whatever. So I'm thinking we're just gonna do this. And let's stay there. And the goal is for him to attack up the hill, so we do as much damage as possible. Thank you. Heal back up. You go there, fortify up, we'll take Zanzibar, we'll send you to Fez, go. A little late for double XP, he got the tribal village. Well, I'll still get double XP from this, right? From combat. I assume you get it for combat too, right? Alright, let's go take you on. No defending, unleash the scouts. Yo, you win by defending in this game. That's how you win. Fighting. So, the, he would have leveled had it not been for the fact that he got a level. He built out another warrior. How dare you. How freaking dare you? So you're up to 23 combat strength. This is going to be a painful fight. Uh, you're crossing the river. Let's do that. You also have palace guards, which sucks. I need to heal you up to full HP. Blood for the blood god. Yes! We do not sow, okay? We are the freaking krakens right now, man. We do not sow. We take. We pillage. Oh, we probably should, um... Maybe flank the city before we actually attack it, so we can actually do full damage. Or, uh, uh, not let him gain HP. Get you over here. Just need more scouts, buy scouts. I'm thinking about buying a warrior, so, a uh, builder, so we can get, uh, scouts out quicker. Pachacuti in Hi, Pachacuti. We're too busy to chat. We're here to kill. Seems like such a bad idea. The city state's outproducing us right now. Fortify. Uh, sorry, you are not welcome. It is There's not a promotion? Hell yeah, dude. You know, it'd be awesome if we had the plus freaking seven attack. Oh, you didn't get the kill. No. Could save the promo for healing. Well, we needed healing, so. Oh, but you're saying I everyone else. Yeah, but I'd rather get them leveled up. I'd rather get him leveled up. Hey, Pacha Cutie. I don't know where you're at. That's what I think of you. Get out of my land. We're here to kill you. That's the positive aspect. You may run. You may hide. In the end, you're gonna die. Alright, now that we're sieging, we can actually do this. Okay, do that, do that. Mm, we should have gone craftsmanship and military tradition, but whatever. Oh my god, piss off with your extra freaking warriors. Just heal up, he's still sieged. Ah, more bits, flying Porygon! We love aggressive pound maker. <laughs> Thank you. Kill the inferior scout. We're trying, dang it! He's running, he's faster than us. Ah, crap. 
This is a problem. This is a problem. We actually have to run. We have to run slightly. Who knew fighting a freaking city-state was the worst idea ever? We could be killing Pachacuti right now. You go over there. He keeps popping out troops a little too quick for us, but that's fine. Scout versus scout. <laughs> it's fine to lose a scout if the cream rises to the top. No, I want him to have levels, man. He's close to leveling. I don't think that's how it works. Uh, you, We didn't use your first one. There you go. See, like, look at how close he is to leveling. I think it's worth it to keep him alive. Alright, Zanzibar's falling. Finally. Finally. By a scout. Oh my gosh. We're building scouts. How many more scouts do we want? There. There's another friggin' scout. Let's go. I bypassed a trade route for that. I actually kind of like the idea of leaving the first promotion just to uh, get the city attack. <laughs> All of the scouts. Uh, well, he can't spawn warriors if we surround his city, right? I'm pretty sure it doesn't work that way, but you know. There you go! There you freaking go! We took a city. Alright, let's find freaking Pachacuti. Let's freaking go. Pretty sure he's this way. He has no idea what's coming for him. Literally, I doubt he has any idea what's coming for him. I'm pretty sure... If we're playing a player right now, they wouldn't even know what's coming for them. Alright. Uh, heal up. You go that way. You heal. You heal. We want our scouts back up to full HP. The we're in our borders. Chocolate Hills. That's seriously the name of it? Huh. You go that way. We gotta find Pachacuti now. Unfortunately, we don't have a trader out all the way over here, so it's taking a little bit uh, longer to get there than we would like. We actually have an extra trader out too, but oh well. Uh, production. There you go. Plus 20 faith. That's unfortunate. Too bad it didn't give us a scout. <laughs> New meta. <laughs> I hope not. I hope not. Next time we multiplayer, though, I might have to do this. I might have to do this, just because it'll be hilarious. No one expects the Kree Scout Inquisition. That doesn't work. Declares war before you even know where they live. Pretty much. Pretty much. We're trying to kill a scout, his inferior scout, because he dared invading our territory. Hey! God of the Forge counts for scouts? I don't know. We actually don't have 25. But thank you for the bits again. The scout war chant. It's like, shink, shink. Let's get over here. I'm pretty sure we just school him right now. In military strength. Yeah. We're playing on the low difficulty, so this was never going to be hard. Spread out, my scout friends. Find and destroy all who oppose the mighty... Bronze Brian. Alright, screw this. We're going for Fez now, too, because... Um... We must conquer everything on this land. Scouts are cheap and OP. Ah, Now there's Jerusalem, too. I don't want to take Jerusalem as well. How freaking large is this dual map? Oh my god! Come on, game! Kree Wars scouring the lands looking for murder. <laughs> yes. That is the plan. Okay, you go there for real quick. Uh, okay, we found the coast. They have a builder. They make it for you. Exactly. Hi, we're here to um, steal your uh, builder. Thank you. Uh, we don't want to hang out there, though. We want to hang out there. And then you're going to get sent to our other city so we can uh, advance a little quicker. We probably should go declare war too right away here on Jerusalem if we're going to be fair. Like, it seems only fitting that we declare war on Jerusalem, although we just took territory. He's running out of spaces to be hiding right now, Pachacuti. 
Build a unique improvement for housing? Your city isn't growing? Meh. It's fine. We will take other cities. We do not sow. That means we do not build, okay? We, we, we refuse to build. We take what we need. We take everything we need and or want. Alright, you just go up there. That's fine. Uh, we want to surround the city before we actually start attacking it this time. Unlike last time. You're actually going to attack that guy, though, which is maybe a bad idea. But Alright, you're coming over there. Uh, skip. Oh my god. Uh, skip one turn. Go there. Go there. We need to send you down here. We're going for Fez. What happened to his warrior? Yeah, he did attack that guy. That was unfortunate. Oh, uh, that's okay, because I can sit here and go pillage. And you run away this way, because he can't catch us, because we're faster than him. What's up? Boom. Scouts are making the growth by force. Yes. Welcome to dystopia. Let Welcome to the new age. Oh, well, there's alpine training, too. Whoa. Uh oh, there he is. Hello. I'm here to kill you. I want you fortified. Oh, the builder. Let's take the builder this way. And we're going to try getting him up and around. We'll see how that works. Oh, <gasps> no. No. How dare you? How dare you? Die! How freaking dare you? Oh my gosh, now I'm mad. Now we're gonna raise Jerusalem to the ground. Before, we were just gonna kill him and conquer him. Now we're raising him to the ground, because how dare he? Hi, Pachacuti. Buy another scout for more bloodshed? Uh, Let's just promote you. I'm still going Alpine training. She actually bought over there. Make a slave scout? I don't know how you make a slave scout. That that sounds kind of wrong in many ways. Okay, you're fortifying, which is all that matters. Although, theoretically, I should actually put you here to fortify you, because that's a hill. Uh, you go up there, and then you're coming over there. Cool. Um, You got a promotion. Can move after attacking. Yeah. Oh, we promoted you. We can't actually finish the attack. There we go. Let's get around for the Pachacuti lands. Oh, poor Pachacuti. You don't even know what's about to happen. Can I get right there real quick? Oh my gosh, right here. Come on, AI. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't cross the water. Don't cross the water. Okay, there's no one over here to kill. So we're going to go kill that guy. I think, I think many things are wrong with this, Brian. Yeah. I think, I think you're right. Okay, we're here to pillage, by the way. Yeah, we can pillage more gold to get more scouts. What is up? New freaking meta, indeed. Oof, I almost bought a slinger there. Almost bought a slinger. Dang it, he crossed. All right, whatever. We'll hang out there. Okay, Jerusalem is now mine. You need to skip. Uh, we are completely surrounded. You're full HP. Let's go. Um, this can put you at really low HP. That's fine. There you go. Let's bring in the reinforcements. See how snowballs kill you? I mean, we are playing on a very low difficulty, which is helping. So, you know. Just saying. If this was on a higher difficulty, this would not be happening. Ah, crap. We can't get another one. Mm, pillage the farm. Cross the water. I don't care. Pillage the farm. You need to be reinforced. Um, let's move you back that way. Let's get you there. And then you're going to attack next turn. You got a level. Yeah, might as well. What? Oh, you can move and attack. Gotcha. Wasteful war. Go here, start taking the city, kill him off. Probably should have killed him off there and use the full HP guy, but whatever. I'd be curious to see if this is tangible in deity. I don't think it is. I can't imagine. I can't imagine this being feasible. We can't even surround the thing without a ship. 
I think I'm gonna have to get a ship. Not to attack with. But I think I have to buy a ship just so I can siege it. Otherwise, I don't think it's possible. We're gonna need like five times uh, as many troops as what we have right now. Only one to fan no ships. I don't think it's possible though. We're gonna need a hundred scouts. Oh, so build a hundred scouts. I know, blah, blah, blah. Oh my gosh, you guys are terrible. I don't even need to see what chat says. I know exactly what you're gonna say. Do you have an upgrade, by the way? No, you don't. Oh no, we're raising you because you murdered my poor guy. How dare you. <laughs> oh, then use a thousand scouts. I hate you all. I hate you all. All right, you all need to heal five a turn, unfortunately. Wait, 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 wait. We have some upgrades here. Promotions, let's go. Promote. 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 And then rest. Okay, cool. Just get a boat. Ah, uh, I'm told no boats, so... Apparently, now we can't do boats. We just gotta apparently just do scouts. It's gonna take 6,000 years. Let's get them up to full HP before we start attacking out. <laughs> the screams of the people. Uh, you, I, how much do you, more of an army do you want? There was one build on that guy. Yo, no, don't be attacking me. That's not how this works, dude. No, piss off. Freaking barbarians. Hello. Hello. <laughs> ah, that felt good. That felt good. Call it the new meta. Uh, you heal up. I hit F. And then you can come around this way. When barking the scout work? Ooh, actually it will. Good point. Ship building. We need two galleys to boost it though, but... Can't do galleys, so no. Freaking heck. Well, this scout's gonna die because the freaking barbarian joined the fight. I call it bull crap. I call it collusion. Clearly, barbarians are the Apache cooties paying the barbarians. Clearly, that's the only thing that could be happening here. Okay, you come this way. So mad. So mad. Ship building 50 turns. Uh, what else am I supposed to do? What else am I supposed to freaking do? At this point, I'm just trying to get as many scouts around here as possible so we can just like wave after wave crash them against the city walls. Uh... Oh, thank you. Thank you for pillaging the one freaking tile I built. Thank you, Drought. That was just so extraordinarily awesome of you. Uh, military tradition is done so we can get our bonuses now. Thank you. Floodplains. We get a great bath. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Scouts only, Brian. <laughs> I was about to build a building. What the freaking heck? We do not so, man. Settle in the same spot. It was losing loyalty. Aha! We can pillage for 40 science, which puts us almost a fourth of the way there. This city's gonna be impossible to take, guys. Oh, this is the worst possible location for a city. You have liquid money for more scouts? And the barbarians are shooting us! Why? Why? All right, there's a chance if the barbarians just keep shooting him that we have a shot here. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're wrong. I'm pretty sure, like, we're going to start doing it. So 23. All right, well, we got wave two. You might actually be right. This might just work by just sending bodies. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Why are you not attacking, barbarians? Why are you not attacking? I call bullcrap, man. I'm calling bullcrap. Okay, run away. 
You got a promotion. You will live. Alright, whatever. That's fine. We get a second attack off. You need amphibious scouts. That's why we're working on shipbuilding. That's why we're working on shipbuilding. Okay, you got an attack here. You're running away. You are going here. Then you're good there. You uh, do not have a promotion, so just heal up. Skip. Just keep suiciding. That's what we're doing. I'm not actually going to suicide. Because I don't want to rebuild, if at all possible. You retreat, and then you go here. Okay, well, there you go. Promote. Promote. And start moving everyone west. Freaking barbarians, man. How are we gonna do this with these freaking barbarians? Oh, they ran away! What the hell? Check military strength, he's zero. He's got 20, he's got one warrior. This was never gonna be a fight. The only thing he's got going for him is the fact that we only have, like, we're gonna have to wave attack him here. Which means I need troops going this way. Okay, I think once we get all of these guys up to the front lines, it should be GG. Except we're only going to be able to attack the city from three locations at once, which is really crap. Nah, you're going to shoot me again, aren't you? Promote. Terrain. Promote. Terrain. Heal. 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 Move this way. Move this way. Pachikuri must be horrified. Pachikuri's gotta be like, what the hell is happening right now? <laughs> oh my god, these- Why are you not attacking the city center? I don't understand. That pisses me off. Uh, Brian, stop doing hill terrain. You have Matterhorn. No, I know I'm doing that, so our level 3 upgrade... I'm just doing that for the upgrade. I know it's duplicating. I literally have no one that has an upgrade. Mm. Like, I'm doing it so I can get to ambush. I guess technically I could do ranger into gorilla, can't I? No. Well, all right, never mind. You're right. Inquiry. We need uh, scout bonuses. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Gonna be a hard fight, but we shall prevail. I don't know. I don't know about this prevailing aspect of it. It's gonna be a fight. Oh, you're good to move. He's got a 30 combat strength. This is getting a little scary. It's getting a little scary. Because now we're outclassed by 20. <laughs> okay, I think I'm cool with that. Uh, he can shoot over hills because the AI cheats. Ooh, we could get oligarchy actually. Yeah, and then the oligarchy gives us plus four. Uh, forget a governor, we don't need it. Or really, a governor doesn't do anything. Uh, I think you went the wrong way, but whatever. Stay there. It's too many units to move. Oh my god. Really, barbarians? Really, barbarians? Really, barbarians? I don't need to kill the archer, do I? Nah, he killed the archer. I don't have to kill the archer. Why should I waste time killing the archer? My scouts don't need to kill. Zerg rush. That's exactly what's happening here. Um, I'm just waiting probably another 20 turns here or so. Alright, you just uh, uh, stay here. Stay on the hill. Actually, this hill's fine, too. But don't attack. Definitely don't attack. Go this way. Fortify. Heal. Good idea to turn barbs off. Yeah, apparently. Do that and that. Probably have enough at this point. Probably have enough. I 
think I have to actually do that real quick. Just so he doesn't kill him. You heal. You heal. And we should be good there. Uh, go all the way to that city, please. And everyone is moving this way. Almost there. Don't wait, just keep attacking. Yeah, but they're going to heal back up. If I don't have enough troops there, they're going to heal back up to full HP, and I'm just going to suicide for no reason. So we're getting there, don't worry. But I want to get my troops healed up first. Let's get both of you guys healed up. We don't care. Go, go, go. I want, like, a nice couple waves of troops. Also, keep in mind, these guys are all going to die, because this is going to shoot them as soon as we move out. Which is so stupid. So stupid. Oh, he actually just built a galley. Oh, that's going to chase the barbarians away. That's actually helpful for us. Yeah, that was actually very helpful. All right, let's start moving in then. Let's wait one more turn. See what happens with the galley. We'll go from there. Mm, skip, 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 skip. Freaking barbarians. Why are there horsemen up there? <laughs> Why? All right, let's go. All glory to the scoutmaster. Heal, heal, heal. Uh, you go there. You go there. You go there. Piss off and leave me alone. Piss off and leave me alone. Uh, I'm pretty sure this wave's gonna fail. Ah, uh, this is so immoral. Make his city revolt due to war awareness? <laughs> what? He's peacing me. He's afraid now. Of course the barbarian attacks me. Why would the barbarian not attack me? I kind of want to pillage for the 45 science just so I can get in the water. But, you know what? The funny thing is we can suicide our guys and then attack with the second wave, which is kind of hilarious. Okay, I keep bringing everyone forward. You keep going here, you go here, you go there. It'd be nice if I could build a ship and kill off this dude. It'd be nice if he killed off this dude. Okay, let's just skip. Skip rest of the turn. He has lower HP now than when we started, at least. Come on, you got a promotion. Ooh, okay. Okay. We can do that, we can do that. I love how the Barbarian's literally saving his life right now. I think we got this, though. I think we got this. I don't know why I moved units into a spot that just got occupied, but that's okay. Uh, not enough movement points. Skip, 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 skip. Uh, skip. Uh, you're moving down this way. We literally just had you move there. That quadrant must be like target practice. <laughs> Basically. This is the most ridiculous thing I think I've ever done in this game. All right, you're going there because you got a promotion, which is going to be good for another attack. Might be able to promote some of these guys. Oh, no. Oh, we have a guy right there. That's why. You're actually... Oh, you survived. <gasps> Guys, we're about to do it. We're about to do it. Yes. You know what's going to suck is this is going to count a win uh, as a win for us. And I don't actually want this to count as a win for us. <laughs> uh, Scout Kanga deadline. That's kind of what's happening right now. Let's just force quit because we should have this next turn. We will now have a win as the Kree. Because of suicidal scouts. <laughs> its face may change throughout the ages. Nope, we never have to play Poundmaker again. I don't know what you guys are talking about. It's done. No one knows. No one remembers why this happened. Oh, uh, that was great. This is the new badass meta. Oh my gosh. That was ridiculous. Alright, so let's go check out our new game real quick. So this is a new game that we have a Let's Play series starting tomorrow on. Uh, the game is called uh, Factory Town. So essentially what it is, is it is a game that is half um, Factorio and half uh, like Banished or something along those lines. So 
Hey, sword, thank you for the 300 bits. Thank you, dude, that's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and get this on screen. Hold up, I have to switch back to this. And then we have the game capture, which I never ever have to switch this in live stream. Uh, factory town, boom. I don't know, my position's probably gonna be weird too. Okay. Oh no, I can't see chat. Ah, options, video. We want a windowed mode, please. There we go. Okay. So, the plan with this game, what's cool about this game is, so we're basically trying to build a town like most town builders. What's unique about this is you're actually, uh, like Factorial, uh, supposed to, like, uh, automate your town as much as possible. So we're gonna go ahead and start a brand new game. We're gonna create a whole, uh, brand new biome and everything like that. I don't really care about the tips, uh, the pips, or the tips, rather. Um, but you'll notice that we start with these builders. And so I'm gonna go send, for example, this builder to go chop a tree. And you'll see that he's gonna chop down the tree. He's gonna go deposit it there in the, uh, city center, or our base, which is where basically everything gets funded to in the beginning. As we progress through the game, we unlock things like um, uh, uh, barns and stuff like that and so then sometimes they can deposit those in those buildings instead of uh, the uh, base. The other thing that happens is you can build chutes, you can build um, um, carts which will transport uh, goods for you. You can also then build uh, eventually conveyor belts and then there's even like magic as the game goes on as well too. Alright sword, I'll see you later. It's broke at Harvest Moon. Eh, it's kind of. The art style wasn't my favorite, but I actually really, really enjoy the game. So first things first, I'm gonna get my four, uh, three of my builders to go do that, and then I think I'm gonna go have you work on stone. Can you work stone in the water? I actually don't know if that is a thing. No, they can't work. Oh, they can work stone in the water. No, he's gathering water. He's gathering water, not stone, isn't he? Yeah, he's gathering water, not stone. All right, well, stone is way the freaking heck over there, so that's gonna be bad. All right, I'll see you, sword. Um, so now that we got 15 wood, uh, we're good there. What's our next mission is to build a house. So we can go here, we can throw down a house. Um, we will put a house, doesn't really matter right away. We want a house near grains, uh, at least initially. So we'll go put it here, let's rotate it. And we're gonna put it somewhere over here. And now that we have our first house, what we're gonna want is we're gonna wanna get a couple extra builders. So the house basically gives you extra worker capacity. And I'm gonna be moving a little bit quick here. And then with these workers, we're gonna go send them for the grain. And so then they're gonna harvest the grain and they're gonna take the grain back to the house. That does two things. Number one, that gives us one coin. And then for every house that you're supplying with grain, you get plus one happiness. Uh, I did a, we have a YouTube series with this tomorrow. Uh, going live tomorrow so we're just basically doing a quick preview of it we're not going to play this for super long all right then the other thing is we can build paths i'm just kind of showing off the game so you guys know what's on youtube tomorrow so we can build a path here and then you'll notice that these guys will take the path and they'll move a lot quicker so now you see they take the path and they go a lot quicker so that's how that works the paths, though, cost one wood, so you gotta have enough wood. And now they're talking about a lumber mill. So we're gonna wanna build a lumber mill, and we'll wanna build this on the water, actually, for um, the future. And we don't have enough. We're missing... What are we missing to build a lumber mill? What are we missing for the lumber mill? Oh, we don't have pop. That's it. I need to build a second house. I forget, you need an extra pop for it. So we're gonna build then our second house here. And now ideally one of these guys will put food in one house and the other is gonna put it in the other house. So you see they both went there. So what I think I want you to do is I'm gonna have you force uh, deposit your food in this one. So we got two happiness now, we have a couple extra pops. So let's go ahead and grab the lumber mill and we're gonna pop out the lumber mill right here. I think I'm actually gonna keep you like that. I think that's fine. So it's kind of like a clicker game, but you're building infrastructure. Uh, to an extent, to an extent, unlike a clicker game though, like you have a little bit more, um, I mean, you're basically trying to automate everything. So what's really cool about the game, and let's actually pull up the trailer really quickly. So, uh, factory town trailer. You can see some pretty crazy freaking um, towns eventually. So let's full screen chrome this. 
And so then eventually, like you can see the shoots working here. And so eventually that's just gonna automate. And so the whole idea is basically just to keep building up your town and gets bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. And, bigger. and then you get like the stuff like this, which is really cool. And I didn't even know you could do that, but you can build bridges and stuff like that. And um, I was like, dang, that looks freaking cool. And then, like I said before, there's like magic and stuff like that. And it like powers your city. I'm not hundred percent how the magic works yet, but like that, I was like, dang, I want to do that right there. So that's going to be, um, this is what's going on on YouTube. Uh, that'll be launching tomorrow on YouTube. So you guys can check that out. Um, we're actually just going to wrap up the live stream now because I'm tired. I want to go. Um, but thank you everyone who stopped by tonight. We had fun. We'll be back Thursday at 2 PM Eastern. And so if you're in European, time GMT uh, time did change so that should be now 6 p.m. GMT I think again so we're gonna be back to that uh, we might continue with our Korea game we might start over I don't know what we'll do with that but um, that's gonna be going down on Thursday and um, everything else with YouTube is pretty much as is Canada has been a lot of fun enjoying that XCOM has been a lot of fun although I hadn't recorded in a couple days so tomorrow I'm gonna bulk record that so um, thanks everyone for stopping by uh, thank you flying Porygon for the bits thank you um sword kill for the bits uh then who else subscribed today who else gave bits let's scroll down the list real quick uh bits 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 thank you a kester for the bits i appreciate that wool day thank you for the two month subscription um a there thank you for the subscription as well uh come a devil thank you for the subscription and a kester thank you for the subscription 10 30 oh that was yeah 10 30 88 malik i think i missed you thank you for the subscription as well and eagle joey too so thank you all and i will see you guys uh later so bye everyone